welcome back to the phonetics corner we have been covering all the consonant sounds and symbols out of those 44 phonemes and then we started with our vowel sounds there are 20 vowel sounds in that 20 12 monophthongs and 8 diphthongs in that 12 monophthongs we have 7 short vowels and five long vowels then we did cover six short vowels with its uh, examples how each one should be sounded pronounced properly with its uh, correct articulation modulation okay so the short vowels we have covered so far six of them there are seven they are a a e a e u and today will be upside down e that is schwa sound most commonly used vowel sound what's that most commonly used vowel sound that is schwa sound it is a, a weak vowel sound unstressed no stress unaccented not much giving stress or emphasis so it is a weak vowel can be a lazy sound as well we could use that in a very casual speech in our communication with the others so somewhat this sound is not pronounced fully it is the phonetic symbol is a upside down e let's have some that we have to be very careful how to pronounce certain words as it comes with the at the beginning as a schwa sound okay schwa upside down e upside down short e okay upside down uh, the small case letter in the english alphabet not the capital of course okay so upside down small case letter in the english alphabet schwa sound a weak sound unstressed ready for the examples okay let's have some at the beginning it could be the letter starts with a the sound is like a about i don't say about about that stress give to b a b o u t that's the spelling for about okay about you see b as comes as a first stressed syllable this a has unstressed sound okay a is an unstressed syllable about again again in the phonetic symbol you would see that first letter as a phonetic symbol as a e upside down e that's a schwa sound about again around account achieve okay that's a but uh, it's a sound achieve hmm? enemy enemy got it okay so it is a about again around account achieve enemy a very few at a time we will have more if you notice when we type in google or any other uh, search engine when you type the word and then meaning or the pronunciation you will see that phonetic symbol with the bar sign separated okay so let's have some in the middle with this uh, schwa sound people it's not a people okay it's people by the way you know the difference between people and peoples 
people the people belong to one nation one country peoples the people all over the country different nations okay so people there we will have the the schwa sound schwa upside down e after second p what's the spelling p e o p l e okay after the second p you will see that a upside down e that's a people then polite polite okay it is after the first p polite polite then parrot parrot that is again after the uh, third letter what is the third letter r then r double r is there it sounded as one r so you will see that uh, right before that last letter t you will see that schwa sound schwa letter upside down e parrot then pursue 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 means something that you aim for in your life pursue look for achieve to get okay to get to gain for your life freedom bottom okay second last letter gets uh, this uh, schwa sound upside down e freedom bottom polite people then parrot then give me another one family family okay it is uh, with that i you will have that uh, sound schwa sound family it's not a family it is a family so at the beginning one achieve or account about again then in the middle somewhere people parrot freedom bottom polite pursue so how fun and keep up with your good work be polite and try to achieve what you pursue for in your life bye bye